Hey you guys So today I have another wig for y'all Yes another wig But at least it's not Bobby Boss this time Because I've just been on a roll with Bobby Boss It's a Otre wig And this wig is brought to you by Hair So Fly Thank you so much Hair So Fly for sending me this wig I'll be sure to see the link below to this wig Their direct store and also their wig blog So let me get the stock cart off for you guys. The brand of the wig that I have today is Ultra. I have one of their lace front, lace front wigs. Lace front, lace front wig. That's what it says on the card, y'all. So the style that I have is Issa. Ha! Ha ha! It's a wig. So the color that I have is DR425. This wig comes with a Swiss lace L parting. It does say it has a soft, flexible stretch cap. This wig is curling iron safe up to 400 degrees. Yes? What you looking at me for? Oh, gosh. In the back of the card, I come with a care guide also for you guys that care about like directions on how to care for your So huge shout out to Natural Joy Channel because without her, I would have never picked this gorgeous color out. You guys, look at this color. It is so freaking gorgeous. Wow, it's so gorgeous. So if you haven't checked out her video, I'll be sure to see the link below to her video because she totally slayed. I'll leave the link below. Natural Joy, go girl. Slay all day, every day. So... <laughs> This is the wig. It is a bob. The texture of this wig is on the yakky side. It feels so great. I cannot stop touching it. It's a coarse feeling. Not everybody love that coarse feeling, but I love that coarse feeling because it mimics my hair. So this is the wig. You have your red, and then you have your black roots. The black roots is like a color number one. When you get this wig, it comes with Swiss lace. The parting is on the right side. You also have two combs in the front by the temple. You also get another comb in the back with your adjustable straps. And this is the way the parting looks. It is a nobody, nobody, no, no. That got to be plucked. So I'm just going to go ahead, pluck the parting, and compare the partings and come right back to you guys. So this is the best I could do with the parting. This is how the parting kind of comes in the way. Like, if I pluck it anymore and try to make it straighter, then the tracks is going to start showing. The way my parting came was a little bit squiggly. It wasn't that well done. So don't think I can't pluck a parting now because I can't, okay? I just don't know what's going on with this one. But otherwise, I'm just going to state my quick thoughts on this wig. The texture is very bomb, honestly. The density of this wig is kind of medium. It's not too heavy. Also, I love the coloring. I love how the black roots fade into the red color. It looks super, super natural. The texture is so nice, you guys. Like, oh my God, it is a coarse texture. Not too coarse, but it's like... It actually feels like some African-American hair in kind of a way. But kind of blown out, you know? As for the cut on the bottom, I think the cut is very, very nice. It is even. As for the size of the wig, this wig is big head friendly. If you have a small head, I do believe it's small head friendly too. If you have a humongous head, I do think it is is humongous head friendly you just have to braid your hair or like get it really sleek really good right here i'm just showing you guys what the hairline looks like it is pretty straight 
so if you want you can leave your hair out with that but if you're okay with that then you can just leave it alone as always thank you guys so much for watching and have a great day later